check the agreement that Kenya, for instance, entered into uh, with the uh, UK. There are clauses that retain the sovereignty of Kenya. All the visiting forces will require visas before they come to Kenyan lands. They require permits before they, they fly over Kenyan airspace or they, 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 they enter Kenya's territorial sea. They, they, they are subject to all the immigration laws, all the laws within the country, all the customs laws within the country. So they are not held above the laws of Kenya. Come to Ghana. You look at this agreement and you see that everything about our sovereignty will be gone. And the most annoying part of it is that ministers and members of parliament of this government, instead of convincing us about the need for such an agreement, they go around saying that Ghana has no sovereignty to protect. If they think that Ghana has no sovereignty to protect, we know that Ghana has sovereignty to protect and we will protect that sovereignty. This is not going to be the last one. We are going to do several manifestations and take all lawful means to ensure that this agreement does not work in this country.